Do you suffer from kidney failure, premenstrual syndrome, or depression? All these ailments can be caused or made worse by copper toxicity. Copper is the 27th element on the periodic table and is found in many foods and useful products. Although copper is useful in the body, it can have some harmful side effects. Most cases of copper toxicity are caused by copper piping or glue wear. Many new houses have been switched from traditional zinc piping to copper, so the possibility of toxicity is high. To prevent toxicity, it suggests that people take magnesium or vitamin C to block absorption. If you already suffer from toxicity, you take molybdenum to increase the loss of copper in urine. It is also important to have enough zinc in your diet to regulate copper levels. Although more rare, copper deficiency is possible. If you are deficient in copper, you may have trouble breathing or be anemic. Copper helps produce red blood cells, which carry oxygen. So the less copper you have, the less oxygen gets to your cells. Also because copper helps transport iron, you may become anemic. If deficient in copper eating, nuts and oysters may help. Also, copper, copper supplements are available. But always remember to ask a doctor before taking them, so it doesn't make the problem worse. Remember to eat a diet rich in copper to keep yourself healthy.